Now to an Eyewitness News exclusive. A man makes a disturbing discovery during a Father's Day meal in Queens. When he asked for a receipt for his order, order he saw this message along with the usual meal request. It said, please spit in it too. Eyewitness News reporter Stefan Kim spoke to the customer and the manager at that popular restaurant. On a scorching hot summer night, what's better than a cold brew? Pair it with a juicy burger, cheddar cheese, well done, toast the bread, and please spit in it too. Don't forget the mayo. Wait, spit? I eat my burger already, and I feel like I feel like I want to throw up. In this exclusive interview with Eyewitness News, Curtis May says it all started because his order got mixed up. So he asked his waitress for the receipt, and that's when he noticed that extra ingredient. I asked her, I was like, why would you do this? And she couldn't explain it. She's like, well, I didn't do it. So I was like, well, who prints out the receipt? So she says, I take it up there and I print it out myself. So you're telling me you did it. Uh -huh. So why are you lying about it? So she says, um, she just walked off. The Seacliff man says he was being treated to a Father's Day dinner by his daughter and granddaughter at the Bohemian Hall and Beer Garden in Astoria when it happened. He says the evening started off pleasant. She was very nice. She came up to the table. Hi, guys. How you doing? May says the manager fired the waitress immediately and he got a refund, of course. He said, he's like, well, um, how can I compensate you? I was like, you can't. I mean, how can you kind of say someone spitting in your food? And you already ate this. And I ate this already. The manager tells Eyewitness News he had never had a problem with this employee before. Food service, he says, is a stressful job, but it was unacceptable. He adds that it's very unlikely a cook actually spat in the burger, but he understands why the customer is upset. By the way, the Bohemian Hall and Beer Garden has an A rating from the Department of Health. In Astoria, Safan Kim, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.